Hello, Dr. Bridget here with another prescription for success. Today I'm going to be talking about have you got a fixed mindset or a growth mindset? And either is absolutely fine. And the reason I'm doing this um, blog today is because I'm in the middle of developing a questionnaire for my clients, for my mastermind groups, for potential clients, as well as to whether people have a fixed or a growth mindset. So, you know, if you've got a fixed mindset, then it's a bit like everything that you do always turns out the same way. You always think the same. You always go back to um, the same events from your past and that creates your future. Whereas if you've got a growth mindset, what happens is that you consider everything that's happening in the present and think, well, how can I change that? How can I grow? How can I be different? And how can I do things differently? And, you know, I just want to say that either way is fine. It's just that if you actually want to grow, if you want to take your business, your career, your relationships forward, um, developing a bit more of a growth mindset is going to work really, really well for you. So I'm just going to give you a couple of examples. So suppose you have a scenario where you haven't reached your goals because you have set goals, haven't you? <laughs> so if you, ha you haven't got your goals. So a fixed mindset person would say, oh, well, I haven't got my goals. I've done the best I can. And that's just that. Whereas a growth mindset person would say, well, so I haven't got my goals, but they're still really important. So what went wrong? How can I um, change my mindset? How can I learn things? How can I develop myself in order to still reach the goals? Another example is sometimes when people, you talk about change to people, um, a fixed mindset person would say, oh, no, I don't really, you know, I'm fine as I am. I'd, you know, I've got lots of reasons and excuses. I can, I can stay where I am and I'm fine and I'm happy and whatever. Whereas a growth mindset person would actively seek out opportunities for change, um, particularly in relationship to making their life better, more fulfilled, more happy. And they do whatever it took. Um, another example, uh, you know, if things don't go your way, um, if you've got a fixed mindset, and <laughs> um, I think that sometimes I've done this in the past, I sort of just get really angry and I pick arguments and blame other people. Whereas if you're in a growth mindset, you can just, you know, if it's someone that's caused the problem, you just give them some feedback and you'd move on and uh, look for different ways of doing things. So... Um, as I said, I'm in the middle of developing a questionnaire, so I'm committing to you now that I'm going to have that questionnaire out for you by the time this video goes um, on my website. So have a little look at the PDF there, I've committed. <laughs> have a little look at the PDF and uh, fill it in and drop me some questions um, or make some comments on the bottom of my blog would be really cool. Okay, so Dr. Bridget here, um, looking for opportunities, change and different ways to grow and I'll see you next week. Bye.